I'm gonna go ahead and get straight to the point. I have wasted absolute leaders watching that Lean in the Plug Jason Love video. I ain't gonna hold it up. I saw the video at least 10 times so I can come on here and talk about this shit properly with y'all niggas, bro. I always say you gotta do the most amount of research, uh, get the most facts you can. <laughs> I never say that shit, my nigga. I'm the only one to come on here and never know any facts or research about anything, my nigga. Always, all the time. But this video right here, I had to watch it a lot, my nigga. My first takeaway, niggas will speed run to call anything mid immediately, bro. Whether it's a new album, a new sex tape, whatever the fuck new it may be, niggas calling that shit mid the second it fucking drops. They never even seen the video, they haven't watched it yet, they're not gonna watch that shit, but immediately on Twitter, that shit mad mid, that shit mad mid, I wasted my time for this bullshit, nigga, it just dropped three seconds ago, what did you watch, bro? They putting that shit in at least, like, I don't know, five times speed, my nigga. They watched a whole 25 minute video? In a matter of milliseconds. How the fuck do they do that bullshit, nigga? I have no idea, bro. But I did watch the video at least 10 times. At least 10 times. If I was Adam22, and this is keeping it an absolute buck with y'all niggas, bro. No fucking deer, no 100 cents, no Antikumpo, none of that bullshit, my nigga. If I was Adam, she's not welcome within 35,000 miles of my house. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Absolutely not. I can never look her in the eye as a person again, my nigga. The things that they were doing, my nigga, the positions that she was put inside of, are positions I've never even seen in my goddamn life, bro. They were making up new shit for this one fucking video. There was one position where the nigga was sitting on the fucking bed, my nigga. Like, he was sitting like this normally. Lena was inside his lap, but she was bent over backwards like the fucking grudge off the bed going crazy. Ah, 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 ah. Like, nigga, what the f hell? Nah. No, my nigga. If I was out in that situation, I'd be swinging my fucking hands like the nigga off boys in the hood. Like, no way, nigga. No. Going crazy inside my room, bro. Holy shit. And at the very end of the video... After I thought there is just no possible way this could get more disrespectful, bro. Of course, there is the glory shot, my nigga. When the nigga bust all over the face or the ass or the titties, wherever the fuck it may be, my nigga. I was sitting there beating my meat, waiting for that shit, my nigga. Just thinking of jokes as I was stroking my shit. Like, I'm about to go fucking crazy during this goddamn video, my nigga. And the second that he busted, I was like, wait, what the fuck? I had to rewind it a few times, my nigga. I had to call a fucking technical foul. Wait, hold. Hey, roll the footage back. Roll the footage back, my nigga. There was no nut in the shot, my nigga. I zoomed in, my nigga, on my iPhone. Held it closer to my eyes. The nigga busted inside of her, bro. <laughs> There was no shot because that nigga didn't pull out, bro. The nigga just started slowly like, ah, ah, and didn't pull out, my nigga. He cream pied her, bro. They were making love, my nigga. When I say that they weren't fucking, they weren't having vigorous sex, I would have much rather watched them do that shit as her husband than them sitting there actually just slowly making love type shit, my nigga. I thought I was like intruding on their actual time, bro. I was like, wait a second, am I supposed to be watching this bullshit, my nigga? What is going on right now, bro? They were actually having sex. When you gotta use the actual fucking term, my nigga, they were, they were having coitus, my nigga. Like, <laughs> you gotta get as scientific as possible, bro. Like, they were actually making love. It was crazy to see my nigga. I don't know, bro. I stand still, my nigga. I double down. Apollo, you gotta be a weak ass nigga to not let your girl do some shit like this. Call me fucking, I don't know. What's the nigga's name? Glass Joe off the nigga, off the, off the Little Mac shit, my nigga. I'm Glass Joe. Then I'll be the weak nigga, weakest nigga in the entire fucking world in the game, no matter what the fuck it is, bro. Glass Joe. Sure, my nigga. Glass Poy. I don't give a fuck what you call me. I'm weak. I am weak. I could not marry somebody and then a week later have to witness her getting absolutely pummeled by a huge ass fucking baby arm, my nigga. That shit was at least this goddamn big. He slapped it on her face, my nigga, and it was the entire thing. She was like this, ah, ah, like, uh, no, no, I'm not watching that. I'm not watching that. No, hell nah, bro. But let me know what y'all feel about this shit, my nigga. Am I a weak ass nigga for having to, you know, say I would not ever, ever, ever be okay with my girl doing that shit? Of course, we don't let our girlfriends do anything. We don't ever let somebody do something, but we can definitely feel uncomfortable or be not okay with it happening type shit. I'm not gonna fucking control my future wife's life or control her narrative or nothing like that, bro. Because, you know, that's her. She's her own woman at the end of the fucking day, my nigga. I'm not gonna let her do anything. I don't control that woman. But would I have to have a conversation when she got back home? Like, yo. Wait, so, uh, we didn't get a prenup, um, you can get the kids on the weekends, I'll get them weekdays, like, it didn't even be that conversation, my nigga, like, cause I'm not staying with you, hell nah, bro, I'm pretty sure there's ample, stronger men out there that would be like, Apollo, 
Weak ass nigga. Sure. You got me. You got me. Like, okay, best. Say less, my nigga. I don't give a fuck, bro. How do y'all niggas feel about the situation? Did y'all see the video as well? What was your favorite part of it, nigga? I guess. I don't, I don't know what to fucking ask y'all niggas. I don't know, bro. I'm getting the fuck up out of here. Check on your strong friends. Pray for your enemies. Not least, at least, wish them well. And I'll see y'all niggas next one, bro. Peace.